Cross River State is gradually gaining its place on the world map as one of the states in Nigeria with an aggressive agricultural revolution in the rice value chain. With the establishment of the state's rice seed and seedlings factory, situated at the Good Luck Jonathan Bypass in Calabar, the nursery stage for the seedlings begins from here through different stages of production. And from the factory, the seedlings get transported to various locations across the country based on orders placed for planting. With the aid of an harvester, the plants are harvested and the yields directed into this truck. From the farms, they are later bagged, stored, and ready for the next phase. On one of the farm locations, the state governor, Ben Ayade, expresses excitement that the state is gradually being industrialized. He assures Nigerians of an influx of local rice into the market this season and beyond. I think Cross River will completely stand up and we'll bring you fresh, crispy, vitaminized rice. That's the specific pleasure of the Cross River rice that you're going to be having. Other farmers at the Ayade farm commend the federal government for the border closure, which they say serves as a strong encouragement for the patronage of products from the states. The border being closed had given, will be given a boost to the farmers. And it will also add to the productivity or the efficiency of all our products in the country. This rice meal as it is here is a big plus to Cross River State, it's a big plus to Nigeria, and a big whole plus to the whole of West Africa. Outside the Ayade farms, rice farming and harvesting is also going on here, but this time it's done manually without the use of harvesters. <laughs> These farmers are hopeful that the state government will gradually key them into the modern system of farming in the shortest possible time. I've been with Rasmus since uh, 19, 1980. So have a, this year is not like as compared to other years. This year we have a, a low harvest because the yield is not proper. Still on the rice value chain, the state government has completed the construction of the ultra-modern rice processing factory at Ogoja. With about 90% installation of equipment, this mill is expected to be open to the public in a few weeks.